love the fact it's, it's a time for civilians and military members to come together and just establish stronger connections. And I feel like this day and age, especially having those connections grow in, in times like this, especially at a sporting event, is something that I think is very important. The Army is an opportunity to uh, have a great job, an opportunity and also make your dreams come true and, and provide some stability in your life that you might not know that you could have. So uh, and pursue your dreams, be bold, and uh, maybe do something that, you're, that, you, that gets you out of your comfort zone. Uh, I decided to enlist in the first place because I wanted a place to still play my instrument, have a little bit more stability, and a place to just serve and, and be a selfless person and help other people. And I thought it was going to be a low-key re-enlistment ceremony, but this week my commander was saying, hey, we could work out a situation where the CG of the Fire Center of Excellence could uh, do my re-enlistment ceremony. And I thought nothing would be more memorable than that. So just all the pieces came together, not in my control, and I, but I loved it. I loved every part of it. And I decided to re-enlist because I loved playing my instrument those first few years I was in the Army. Loved being able to serve my country and also just show love and respect to other people around me. There's no better place to do that, I think, than the Army. It was just, it was awesome. I, I heard it was just a rare opportunity that somebody of that status could have my re-enlistment ceremony. So it was awesome and, and everyone was telling me, encouraging me to take the opportunity. So I'm glad I did. I'm definitely glad I did. Uh, I just want to say thank you to all the military members out there. Thanks for your service. and. Uh, Fire strong.